Hi guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. In today's video, we're going to show you how to replace the airbag module on a Mercedes W163, which is the ML first class generation. Stay with us to see how we're going to do that. Don't forget to subscribe and give us a like. We have many videos on our channel about fixing that kind of vehicle and how to remove the airbag as well. So stay with us and see how we do that. First thing that we need to do, we need a flathead screwdriver and we need to move that center, piece, that center piece around the shifter. So we need to go underneath it and gently pry it. As you can see that's where the clips are. It's not holding very, very tight so don't put too much pressure. You need to open the lid now and what you need to do, there is, uh, there is two screws that we need to remove on the bottom with a Phillips screwdriver. Okay, the ones right there, so we can pull that container, that storage container out of there and proceed to the next step. So this is the first one and now just the second one, they don't take very long. Okay, we removed the two screws and now with the screwdriver again you just pull it out. Okay, that, that storage bin is coming out of there, so now you need to open the lid again and what you need to do, we need to remove these two screws right here with a few screwdriver and this is because we cannot access the wires on the bottom. The two wires for the window switches on the back. So just remove these two screws. Okay, we remove the second screw and now you just pull it forward. Okay, like that, careful, you need to pull forward because we have two clips holding there. And now what you need to do, these wires, in order to remove the wires, you need to push this one down and pull on the back of the wire. Okay, like that. And the other one is the same way. Right there you need to push down and pull, but it's hard to show it there because there is, it's very limited room. But as you can see, it came out easy. Okay, now we need to pull the cables out of the groove there, holding it. And what do we need to do now? We need to remove that wood trim right here, the whole thing. So for that purpose you need to be very careful now not to cause any cracks. As you can see this one is cracked here. So now we be very careful with the screwdriver, push with one hand underneath and just start prying. There is a few clips, once we remove it we're going to show you exactly where the clips are so you know where to apply more pressure. Okay and now you need to pull to the back to come out of the grooves. Check. Now you need to make sure that you move your shifter all the way to drive so you can get the wood trim out of there, okay, like that. And what you need to do now, you need to pull the wires on the bottom of it. So that way it gives us room and we can do it outside. You start with this one by pushing the clip out. Okay, this one has one little thing that you need to pull there and just pull the whole clip out. And those are the same way. As you can see, this one right here, the blue thing. Okay, you just push up and pull out. And now the little one as well. Okay, just like that and you pull it out. And this is for the lighter and the light in the ashtray. So you just pull those out. If you need to replace your light, that's where the bulb is. Okay, so here it is, the whole wood trim coming out of there, the whole assembly if you need to replace it. Next thing what we need to do, okay, this is the center console right here on the bottom. There is one, two, and two right behind the shifter, two screws with a few of screwdrivers. So two here and two there, remove all four of those. Okay, we remove the four screws and what you need to do now, you just pull up. You have to have the gear shifter all the way to drive. You pull the back up and it comes right out of there the whole assembly. Alright guys what we need next is a 5 millimeter Allen wrench and you need to pull that uh, black insulation right there so get the cables through the hole and pull it up through the shifter. And now this is where your airbag module is located so what you need to do now at that point you need to make sure that uh, the car is off and the battery is not connected and you should have the battery unconnected for at least 30 minutes prior to remove the airbag module. So we're going to go ahead and disconnect the battery now. So what you need to do next, you need to remove the three bolts right here, one, two, three, with that five millimeter Allen wrench. Remove all three of them. Okay, and now it just comes out of there. You need to pull a little bit to the side, the cables are long. 
And what you need to do, you need to press down there and pull this one and the wires come out of the module. So this is the airbag module. That's how you remove it and replace it on a Mercedes W163. Thank you guys for watching us. Don't forget to subscribe, give us a like. We upload a new video almost every day.